hacking into enemy systems. Await override. Good morning, YouTube. Welcome back to Zaxxon's Gaming. And in today's video, we got for you, well, as you can probably already tell since you clicked the video, you've seen the title. Does it really need to be suspenseful? Of course it does, because it's the Mario's Mystery Block. I mean, just look at that box right there. Look at that artwork. Well, I guess artwork, just a whole bunch of different question mark boxes. But they're all pretty cool. And this one's a little bit bigger than the last one I got, so that's going to be pretty awesome. I'm kind of stoked to see what's inside this box. So yeah, for you, those of you who don't know what Mario's Mystery Block is, it is a monthly subscription service sent to your door once a month for, uh, I think, with shipping is $38 a month. And it isn't just Mario-related stuff. It is anything Nintendo makes. And they usually make a theme box out of it. Uh, one month I got a Zelda theme box. Uh, another month I think it was just uh, Nintendo themed. So I'm kind of curious to see what this one is. And this is the September's. So this is number three. And I'll put some little description notes up here on the screen. So you guys can go check it out. See if you're interested in purchasing this box. So yeah, let's get into this. Kind of open it together and see what we get. So in here first, we got oh, a card. There's a couple cards on top. Let's get those out of the way. Packing slip. Don't need to see that. Beat the heat. So looks like it's going to be a, kind of a summer themed. And there it goes right there. It tells you uh, record, share, enjoy, tag you. Can, Tag using Mario's Mystery Block. All right, first up, we got huh, looks like a cup. It is. It's an Animal Crossing cup. That's actually pretty cute. I like. <laughs> Animal Crossing cup and straw. It's a little plastic. That's pretty cool. It'd be useful. And I never played any of the Animal Crossing games, but you no, know, they're a little cute on there. <laughs> My nieces might like to have this around. Awesome. Now in these boxes, you usually get about I think about four to six items. Usually about four to five items. I think there's always a shirt. And right there, I feel the shirt, so let's go ahead and pull the shirt out. Oh. We got a son with a crazy face on it. <laughs> Looks like he's kind of constipated a little bit. <laughs> Anything on the back? No. Well, that is a pretty funny looking shirt. It is, uh, let's see here. Just a canvas. It's not licensed or anything. If this is from a game, does anybody know if this is from a game? Alright. If you know, uh, send me a, kind of a comment down below. Let me know. Uh, interesting looking shirt. I like the color. Alright, next in. What we got here? Oh, well, looks like a little Mario fan toy. Lights up. That's pretty cool. I'm going to hypnotize you. Is it just a fan? Oh, there's little candies in there too? Yeah? There's little candies in there at the bottom. How do you get those out? Uh, try to deal with that later. I don't want to break anything on here. That's pretty cool. A little Mario light up fan with candies. Looks like something you get like at Disneyland, you know? <laughs> What else we got here? 
Looks like Lego Mario. And a Goomba. And it looks like you assemble them yourself, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> little, little Lego Mario guy. Make a little stand. He's in a little stand in there. Pretty sure you'll find a spot for that little guy. All right, looks like should be the last item in the box. Pretty cool design on the inside. And don't know what this is yet. Let's go ahead and just open it up. Kind of looks like Zelda. Yep, it's Zelda. Just a official product, Bio World from Zelda. Maybe just a little bandana or handkerchief or something. That's pretty cool. All right. And yeah, it was Zelda. The logo there. I think that's a sticker too. No, it's not. All right, that's pretty cool. Well, this probably can't be too expensive, so I'll probably give that about mm, maybe five five dollars for that. They probably charge a little bit more. A little light up Mario fan, which is getting pretty hot, so it's gonna be nice to have this around. I'll also give that about mm, five dollars. The Animal Crossing cup. Now, they probably have this stuff priced a little bit more than what I'm going to say, but you know, I would only pay <laughs> up to $5 for that one as well, too. The Lego Mario with Goomba. Symbol yourself. I mean, it probably can't be too much. I'll be generous. Give it $5. <laughs> and last in the box was that uh, pretty cool shirt, I guess. The Constipated Sun. I always price my shirts twelve dollars, but this one will give about ten to twelve, yeah. So all in all, it wasn't the greatest box, but uh, you know, it's a hit or miss. You can't win them all. Still, uh, some of these items can be used as gifts. Some can be just little decorative pieces, and uh, yeah, nieces will love this one. All in all, it's a it was an okay box. There's been better ones, and I'm sure there'll be better ones next time. So uh, until next time, everybody, if you liked watching the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe down below. Check out my other videos, and until next time, game on.